CES is the biggest consumer electronics show on the planet. And there's always going to be phones and tablets and laptops and, you know, washing machines, the stuff that people know about. But there are tremendous amounts of technology that are maybe a little less useful, um, but are equally interesting and maybe even cooler than a lot of the stuff that you see. So it might not be something that you'll buy, but you're certainly going to want to, it's fun to know about. It's the kind of things that you see on Facebook or Twitter or whatever, that it's just like, this is insane. I can't believe that this exists. Of course, there's always going to be lots about TVs, you know, 4K, that's going to be, it was a big thing last year. I think it's going to be continue to be a big thing this year as well. Um, I think it's probably going to be more about content this year. You know, the TVs already exist. The prices are coming down a little bit more. And I think this year it's really going to be about what are we going to watch on those big, beautiful screens that we've got. Put it together. So, yeah, we're There's a much larger opportunity in, in real wearable things, whether it's rings and jewelry uh, or actual clothing um, that has sensors. There's conductive thread that can actually make clothes have um, some electronic uh, and sensors built into them. So I think that's really going to be the one that will kind of break away from the, the wristband kind of form factor. Find a Starbucks. Updating information for Starbucks. There's apps that allow you to control like your, your home um, temperature, Nest thermostat, those kinds of things. I think we'll see a lot more of that. We've seen some Bluetooth um, pad locks, door locks, sensors that allow you to, to check and see like if your um, cabinet with all your nasty little chemicals and things and you've got children in the house, it'll tell you when that door's been opened so that way you can make sure that your kids aren't getting in where they need to. Just sort of things like that. I think we're gonna see a, a lot more smart home devices uh, and, and Wi-Fi connected things all over the house as well. The big change has been that there are lots of things flying through the air on the show floor, and that's definitely going to continue this year. Drone technology is huge. Personal drones are very big. They just keep getting cheaper, and they just keep getting easier to fly. So definitely, CES, look up. Not, not all of this stuff is just going to be on the floor. Is this the real life? Is this just fantasy? Historically, CES has really been about the big consumer electronics companies, the Sonys, the Toshibas, and of course they're still really big players, but it's been very exciting in recent years to see great new products from small startups. Yeah. 